Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to share the recipe of chicken kebab. This is my amma's recipe and her favorite one. She is only preparing this for our channel. Without further delay, let's get started. Take two onion and chop it finely. We are using this chopper to make our job easy. Next, we are going to grind 400 grams of boneless chicken in this chopper. You can also mince the chicken in a mixer grinder. Make sure not to over grind the chicken. Boneless chicken pieces has to be minced like this. Keep it aside and now we are going to prepare an onion masala. In a kadai, heat 2 tablespoons of sunflower oil. Add in 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. In goes the chopped onion. Sort the onion and the ginger garlic paste nicely until it turns golden brown color. Onion is cooked perfectly. Now add in 1 teaspoon of jeera powder. 1 teaspoon of pepper powder 1 teaspoon of garam masala powder half a teaspoon of turmeric powder 1 tablespoon of kashmiri chilli flakes Sort it nicely so that the raw smell of the masala powders goes off Add in salt as needed for this masala as well as for the chicken Switch off the flame and take it in a mixing bowl This should be the color of the onion masala mix to that, add in half a cup of chopped coriander leaf and quarter cup of chopped mint leaf. Add in the minced chicken. In goes one egg. Mix everything nicely using your hand or spoon and you should get this consistency. Now I am going to refrigerate this kebab mix. Cover it with the lid and keep it in the refrigerator for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, take it out from the refrigerator. Finally, add in 1 tablespoon of corn flour and mix it nicely. Make medium sized balls and flatten it like a patty like this. With this measurement, you will be able to make 11 to 12 kebabs. You can also shape this kebab in a skewer. The kebabs are perfectly shaped and it's time to fry it. Heat a pan and add in enough sunflower oil to shallow fry the kebabs. Place in the kebabs and cook it from low to medium flame. We have already shared the recipe of chicken and prawn kebab using the same method. I leave the recipe link in the description below. This is our favorite kebab and usually we used to have it with sambar rice. When one side of the kebab is cooked, flip it and cook it on the other side. You can freeze this kebab mix and make it when needed. Delicious aromatic chicken kebab is ready to be served now. Do try this chicken kebab and share me the feedback. Subscribe my channel for more interesting recipes like this. If you try this recipe, share me the picture through my Instagram or Facebook account. I'll see you next video. Until then, bye bye and take care.